Hello everyone, welcome back to this video. In this video, let's see the next part of questions in SFH that is 51 to 100. So let us get into the questions and see the answers. So the 51st question, which of the following is not a characteristic of addiction? So the answer is habitual behavior. Which term describes the use of a drug for a purpose for which it is not intended? The answer is misuse. An individual who knowingly tries to protect an addict from natural consequences of his or her destructive behavior. It is enabling. The next question. Addiction involves an excessive dash preoccupation with addictive behavior. Daniel is a person's dash. Daniel is a person's inability to perceive that behavior is self-destructive. 56th question, when increased amount of drug or substance or behavior is needed to produce the desired effect, this phenomenon is known as tolerance. Excessive use of any drug which is illegal or illegal constitute drug abuse. Temporary physical or physiological symptoms that occur when use of an addictive substance is discontinued which is withdrawal. Let us see the 59th question. Process addictions include all of the following except which one? It is the use of retalion to help concentration when studying. Then the next question, 60th question. Charlotte, a college student, is a habitual drinker. She has become preoccupied with obtaining alcohol and obsessed with her need to drink. Charlotte is exhibiting what? It is compulsion. Rebecca takes medications for various conditions including Prenivil that is for high blood pressure, insulin that is for diabetes and Claritin for allergy symptoms. This is an example of polydrug use. 62nd question. Chemicals that relay messages that is impulses from one nerve cell to other nerve cell or other cells which are dash which are neurotransmitters which of the following is not an example of drug misuse here regular use of increasing amounts of cocaine to get high is not an example of drug misuse 64th question a lack of judgment regarding whether a particular substance or behavior will be healthy or damaging to oneself is known as a lack of judgment regarding this is known as loss of control. Which of the following is classified as a stimulant which is a stimulant here it is metamephthamine. Signs of compulsive buying include compulsive uh, buying signs is Repeatedly buying more than what you need or what you can afford is the answer. 67th question. Transdermal drug administration means the drug is dash. Transdermal drug administration that is absorbed through the skin. Drugs in suppository form are absorbed into the bloodstream through the dash. That is rectal or vaginal walls. The psychoactive drug mescaline that is obtained from which plant? Obtained from pure cactus. 70th question. The illicit drug most commonly used in US or United States is dash. It is marijuana. 71st question. Which of the following statements is about cocaine is not true which is not true about cocaine is the question here are the options it can cause drowsiness depression and loss of appetite is the answer 72nd question which of the following statements about amphetamines is true which of the following statements about amphetamines is true the answer is they are stimulants the most noticeable effect of THC the psychoactive substance in marijuana is which are which is the uh, noticeable effect in T 
THC that is bloodshot eyes is the noticeable effect. Morphine, codeine and heroin have what in common? What is the common in between these three is the question. All they are opioids. PCP was originally developed as PCP as originally developed as anesthetic which with which a person remains conscious but feels no pain that is PCP 76th question a mentally sick person has dash he has or he has she has tendency to get upset with change of change of routine then 77th question a person is mentally sick if one is with moods fluctuating between the depression and elation. Then 78th question, community health aims, community health aims in care of infants old, care of infants, improvement of health of all, improvement of health of children, improvement of health of all is the community health. The next question, Overweight in BMI, which is the overweight in BMIs, it is more than 30. Causes of obesity and overweight, what is the cause of obesity and overweight? Energy imbalance between the calories consumed and the calories expended. 81st question, is addiction a dash? Is it a mental disorder, physical disorder or both A and B and none? It is both A and B. What are the reasons for taking drugs? What might be the reasons? To feel good, to feel better, to uh, good, to do better, all of the above, all of the above. 83rd question, what states can do to avoid addiction? Adding higher taxes on sweetened beverages, benefits for organic fruits, availability of healthy food, all of the above, all of the above. 84th question, social, social health hazards include, the social health hazards include stigma, antisocial behavior, higher crime records, all of the above, all of the above. What other factors increase the risk of addiction? What increases the addiction? Early use, mental illness, both A and B, both A and B. Why do people become addicts to drugs while others do not? Why people become drug addicts the answer is aggressive behavior in childhood parental monitoring neighborhood all maybe all what is protective factors for addictions what are the protective factors for addictions positive relationship drug experimentation community poverty all of the above. all of the above might be the answer 88th question types of addictive Behavior, alcoholism, drug op, PM, video gaming, all of the above, all of the above. Mental health hazards include anxiety, depression, organic metal disorders due to substance use, all of the above, all of the above. How is substance use disorder treated? How is substance use disorder is treated? The answer is multiple types of treatment. Recognition of problems, alcohol, drinking, both A and B. Both A and B is the answer. Hyper obesity value in terms of BMI. That is more than 40. 92nd question. In the future, which of the following will play a vital role in helping the gaming industry demystify the nuances of gambling problems? The answer is internet gaming. Researchers, mental health professionals, problem gambling organizations and the casino industry have a responsibility to the problem gamblers themselves to dash, avoid bickering unnecessarily, unite with a common goal or of reducing the costs associated with the gambling or it is reach a consensus, avoid unnecessary bickering avoid unnecessary bakering and unite the common goal and reducing the cost associated with the gambling only. That is the answer. What is the definition of overweight? Overweight is the BMI 25 to 30 kg per m square. 
Which of the following disease does obesity increase the risk of developing? 95th question. The answer is cardiovascular disease. Then the 96th question. Which of these factors is not required for communication growth? Which of the factors are not required for communication growth? Uh, negative atmosphere. Communication is a part of dash skill. It is a soft skill. Communication barriers involves jumping into the conclusion, arguing and debating, fear of offending, all the above. All the above. Ways to improve the communication skills are, which are the different ways to improve the communication skills. One is active listening skills. You need to listen to others. And the hundredth question, goals of communications are to inform and pursue is the question. Let us take the next questions in the third part of the video. Thank you.